Buenas noches. Hello. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. I'm Susana. Nice to meet you. Hi, Susana. Is your first time in class? Yes. Yes, it is. Uh, yesterday I tried to connect, but uh, I have a problem with my cell phone. I will connect uh, by this, by this, uh, I don't know, via or way. <laughs> okay, this way. Uh -huh. ah, okay. Uh, I usually, uh, I'm driving at this time. Oh, but really? I don't know if I will have a problem. Well, the problem is to participate. You know, if you're yes. driving, sometimes yes. you have to work in groups and have to participate. Yes. I will try to uh, stay at um, any place uh, to try connect and have to access to the material. Yeah, I think that would be better. Okay, mm -hmm. I will try. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, welcome. Okay, good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. 
How are you today? Fine. Okay. You. Okay, let's get started this evening. So welcome one more time. Let's see, last class we finished talking about the passive voice or the passive with by. And let me go here. And we did this, we did this exercise. Changing these sentences from the active voice to into the passive voice. Remember Thomas Edison invented the phonograph in 1877. This is active voice. Let me write here just to. So these sentences are in act, what we what is called active voice. And these ones are what we call passive voice. Passive. Yeah. Thomas Edison invented the phonograph in 1877. The phonograph was invented by Thomas Edison in 1877. Okay. Marie Curie discovered radium in 1898. Radium was discovered by Marie Curie in 1898. Gabriel Garcia Marquez wrote 100 Years of Solitude in 1971. 100 Years of Solitude was written by Gabriel Garcia Marquez in 1971. Solitude. Tim Berners-Lee developed the World Wide Web in 1989. The World Wide Web was developed by Tim Berners-Lee in 1980. Wu Peik produced the first digital HDTV, high-definition television, in 1991. The first digital HDTV, high-definition television, was produced by Wu Peik in 1990. Okay. Now, I want you to write some sentences. The next exercise about this is you have to write five statements. I, I will send you to do this in groups, okay? You have to write five statements like these ones or like these ones in the part A of the exercise. So sentences talking about some works of art or some inventions or 
Okay. But the idea is that you, uh, from the five statements, three statements should be true and two statements should be false. Okay. For example, if, if I, let me write an example here. Um, America was covered by Hernan Cortez. This one. Okay. Tell me this sentence. America was discovered by Hernan Cortez. Is that sentence true or false, people? I think it's false. 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 True. Ah, this is all. This. Ah, okay. Why? Because America was discovered by uh, Christopher Columbus. Yeah, so this is four. Okay. Another one could be. Um, Uh, no. Facebook was created by Mark. I'm not sure about the no, soccer, but I think it would see. I don't remember the spelling of this last name. Zuckerberg. Do you know if the spelling is correct? I'm not sure. <laughs> Facebook was created by Mark Zuckerberg. Created. True. Yeah. true. It's true, yeah, this is true. I know. Okay, so the idea is that you have to write three true sentences, three true statements, and three false statements, okay? Then we okay. are going to take turns to read the sentences and the other groups are going to tell us if your sentence is true or false, okay? Okay. So I will send you to working groups to write five sentences per group. Let's see. We are 21. Mm. Okay. Okay, so go to your groups and write five statements, three should be true and two should be false. Using the passive uh, with by, okay? Sentences in the past, in okay. the past, okay? Go to your groups, please.
Join a group, please. Oh, and that okay. is not true mm -hmm. because it was uh, written by Homero. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That could be one of the false. And another one, check. Pasa con el tiempo de un alimento. Hey, people, you should be working together. It's a group work. Uh, sorry, teacher. Uh, I I don't know what we have to do. Vanessa, Jaime, do you know? Yes. Yeah. Teacher, now I am driving and my to my home. Oh my! Okay, we are working. I don't know if you have the manual. Well, let me share the, the picture in the book from the book because we are working on exercise four from the manual, which is this. And I, I wrote a couple of examples. Mm. 
you are writing, you are supposed to be writing together as a group. Uh, sentences using the passive with by. Three of them should be true. Two of them should be fa uh, false. In WhatsApp, you can see the exercise. Uh, the idea is to work together. That's why you're in group. Try to do it, please. Okay. okay. Um, Ejercicio. Que por fue escrita por por Bad Bunny algo así. Michael Jackson. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Many songs. Thriller. Thriller was. Billie, Billie Jean was producer mm -hmm. by Bad Bunny. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> One. Who do you write? Thriller. ¿Cuál sería? Ya no están. ¿Cuál sería? <laughs> ¿Cuál sería? Okay. Well, right. we, yes, uh -huh. we have uh -huh. We have three. True. Three. False. But we have to add two more. What else could be? Uh, like. Hmm. If you no, no, no. Uh, repeat the sentence. No, I mean, I mean, I, I was just thinking in in the other one because I have I heard it. Uh, for example, I didn't present my homework. If it was present. By my classmate. Okay, but. Sí. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. By Álvaro Torres. Yes. Okay. Reencuentro, right? Yes. Reencuentro, uh huh. What song by Álvaro Torres? Yes. But we couldn't change the, the, the name of the song, right, in English, because it's a, a, a properly properly mm -hmm. name of the song, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Another one? Mm. The creator mm. of Apple, Steve Jobs. Okay. Oh. The Roman Colosseum was admitted as a world heritage. Was admitted as a world heritage. But in 1980 by UNESCO.
Good evening. I'm sorry, I was on mute. Hello. Aquí teacher, algo mal de, de salud. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Pero estaría aunque sea de oyente. Okay, okay. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, welcome back. I would like to check some of your sentences. Okay, but let me see. We'll do it by groups. Okay, from group number one. Um, I have Diego, Crisia, and Jancy. Let's see. Diego, can you write one of your sentences, please? Only one. In the chat, right? Or say right? No, right. Oh, okay. Write it in the chat. Okay. Okay. Now, can you read it, please? The Odyssey was written by Shakespeare. Okay. True or false people. Is it that true or false? False. False says somebody there. Uh -huh. Come on, people. I need your answers. I think okay. that's false. Uh, false. Okay, false. Let's, do, let's do something. If you think it is false, thumb, no, thumb up if you think it is true, and thumb down. If you think it is false, where does thumb down, thumb down, here it is. Okay. Come on, I want to see your your thumb. Up, true, down, false. Okay. Ah. Uh -huh. And the others? Ah. Uh -huh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> The Odyssey was written by Shakespeare, Diego? No, it's false. No, that's false. Okay. Who wrote the Odyssey? Homero. Homero. Okay. Thank you very much. Now, team two. I have Ana Lilia, Jaime, Marcelo, and Vanessa. Who wants to write the sentence from group number two? Ana Lilian, Jaime, Marcelo, or Vanessa? Who? Who is going to write the sentence? Teacher, I came late at the class. Ah, so you are going to write the sentence because you came late to the class. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, teacher. Uh, Jaime, Marcelo, Vanessa. Give me, give me a moment, teacher. I, I, todavía no terminado. Okay. I haven't. Uh, I drive me, teacher. Yes. I haven't finished yet. One sentence only, only one, only one. Well, let's give them time, okay? From group, group number three, I have Ernesto, Luis, and Pablo. Who's going to write it? Ernesto, Luis, or Pablo? Huh? Okay, go ahead. Only one, only one sentence. This is our sentence. Okay, can you read it, Pablo? Mona Lisa was painted by Pablo Picasso. Okay, people, true or false? Come on. False. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, some of you think it's true. True. Uh -huh. I think it's true. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Mona Lisa was painted by Pablo Picasso. 
caso. What, what is the answer, Pablo? False. This is false. Because ah. <laughs> by Leonardo da Vinci. Leo yeah, I was painted by Leonardo da Vinci. Okay. Ah, group number two. Marcelo, can you read your sentence, please? Yes, the television was invited by John Lennon. True or false, people? True or false? False. <laughs> false. Oh, so. uh, hey, don't cry, Osvaldo. <laughs> Why? Okay. My mistake. <laughs> so, Marcelo? Uh, it was invented, invited, uh, invented, sorry, by John Loggy Baird. Ah, okay. So it is false. Correct, John Lennon didn't invent it. The television. Okay, group number four. I have Elizabeth. No, uh, yeah, Elizabeth, Julio Cesar, Osvaldo, or Jamie. Who is going to write the sentence? Only one, only one from the group, number four. Me, I write Okay, to Julio, okay, go ahead. The ball. Is what created. Ah, Osvaldo, Osvaldo wrote one already. Okay, Osvaldo, can you read it? I apologize. Uh, that is which half mine was written by Bad Bunny. No. <laughs> <laughs> False. <laughs> False. Totally <laughs> False. Uh, okay. <laughs> A child of mine written by Bad Bunny. Come on. <laughs> okay, that is okay. You, Osvaldo, give us the answer. I know you know the answer. It was written by Guns N' Roses. It is culture. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It was written by Guns N' Roses. Okay, thank you. Um Group number five, Alejandro, Susan, or Jancy. One sentence, please. Me. Uh, okay, Alejandra. The Angels and Demons novel was written by John Grishman. Okay, do you hear people? Can you repeat it, please. The Angels and Demons novel was written by John Grishman. Hmm. Was written. Okay, yeah, what's written? By John Grishman. Okay, what do you think, people? True or false? Or no idea? <laughs> <laughs> do you know? Okay, idea, let's but... take a chance. No let's idea. Let's take a chance. No idea. <laughs> no, no, true or false? No, no idea is not a choice. Uh, false. True. <laughs> okay, false is Natalie. False. False. True. True. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm not sure. Alejandra, enlighten it's us. True. It is true. Yes. Oh, okay. You see, that's because we only watched the movie. We didn't read the book. <laughs> At least me, I only watched the movie. Okay, thank you, Alejandra. Now, group number six, Julissa, Morena, or Natalie? Who is going to give us the sentence? Julissa, Morena, or Natalie? Yes. Uh, okay. TikTok was created by United States of America. Oh. Okay. False. It, false. False. Yes. Ah. False. <laughs> okay. Who created TikTok? In China. 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 I don't know. Yes, it's true. <laughs> no? yes, China. Okay. China. Oh, okay. Chinese. Chinese. Oh. COVID and TikTok. Come on, two plagues. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And the last group, I only have maybe and Guadalupe. I don't know who else was in that group, but maybe or Guadalupe, can you give us your sentence? 
Yes, I don't know. Guadalupe, you want to read it or me? <laughs> um, if you want, you... <laughs> the truth or the false, teacher? Whatever, whatever. So we are going to guess. Okay. The Roman Coliseum was admitted as a world heritage in 2002 by UNESCO. Oh. Can you repeat that again? Yeah. The Roman Coliseum was admitted as a world heritage in 2002 by UNESCO. Okay. What do you think, people? Could be, could be true. <laughs> could be true. <laughs> Sounds. I'm not sure. But not exactly. <laughs> uh, false. Osvaldo said that it's false. false. Do, you, do you know, Osvaldo? The thing is, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jensi said it's true. Okay, so it is true or false, maybe? It's false. Oh, really? Why? It's almost, it's, it's almost true, but the, the year, uh, the right year is 1880. 1880? <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, I'm sorry, oh. 19. Sorry, 19. 1980. 19. Ah, okay, okay, <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, people, I I know you have more sentences, but we don't have more time, yeah, to continue with this. But it was fun. It was interesting. Some of the information you we learned that through through this. Okay, so let me go back here. Oh, uh, any questions so far, people, with this topic, uh, with passive, with by in the past? Maybe it's only clear need... for a while. Okay, uh, maybe some of you, or well, actually everyone, uh, remember to practice the past participle of the verb. Okay, especially the pronunciation, okay? Particularly with the irregular verbs because regular verbs are the same. In simple past and past participle, regular verbs are the same. The problem is with irregular verbs, yeah? For example, write, write, wrote, written. Yeah, it's different, okay? Read. Uh, that is interesting because yeah. read, read, read. 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 Uh-huh. The spelling is the same, but the pronunciation is different. So just to keep that in mind, okay? <clears throat> now, um, well, um, I would like to do this, but we need to move on. We'll practice all, all, all enough of this. Now, uh, some vocabulary, some vocabulary practice. We have these words here and these categories. Yeah, the idea is to classify this vocabulary into these four categories. Currencies, religious groups, industries, and agricultural products. I will send you to working groups again to classify this vocabulary into this chart. Okay? For example, beef. Beef corresponds to which category? Currencies, religious groups, industries, or agricultural products? Agricultural products. Agricultural yeah, products. it should be here, right? So then you write here, beef. You write here the word, okay? That's what you are going to do. But let me send you to work together again. Okay, join your groups, please and complete that exercise. I think five minutes would be enough.
Hello. Hello, Silvia. No tengo muy buena señal. Eh, se me desconectó por un rato. Oh. Okay, I will send you to a group right now. We are working in groups. Okay.
Okay, welcome back. Let's check your work. So let's start with the word beef. We said that it's an uh, agricultural product. Buddhists. Where should There's I write a, Buddhist? Religion. Okay. Religious group. Religious group. Religious group. A Buddhist. Mining. Industry. Industries. Mm. Peso. Uh, currency. 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 Christians. Religious uh, group. Religious, uh, religious group. Muslims. Religious group. Religious group. Religious group. Religious group. Dollar. Currency. 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 Electronics. Industries. 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 Tourism. Industries. Uh, Industries. Industries. Okay. Tourism. Tourism. Cheese. Cultural products. Cultural products. Cultural Cultural Let's practice. Repeat, please. Currencies. 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 Christians. Christians. Muslims. 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 Industries. Industries. Mining. Mining. Electronics. Electronics. Tourism. Tourism. Agricultural products. Agricultural products. Beef. Beef. Wheat. Okay, very good. Wheat. Now, um, I want you to write in the chat one more for currencies. One more for currencies. Everybody, please write. One word more in the category of currencies. Let me see what we have in the chat. Okay, Euro, Limpira, Cordova, Quetzal, Poles, Reales, and now, peso is there. Jen. Okay. Very good. Very good. So, see, you have more vocabulary about currencies. Okay. Euro, Lipira, Cordoba, Quetzal, Soles, Reales, Pesos, Genes. Colón, yeah. SAR, oh, it's a currency. From Russia? Yes. Okay. South African. South Africa. South Africa. Oh, okay. Okay, now what about religious group? Another one? For religious groups. Ah, this is more difficult. <laughs> Islam. 
Um, <coughs> what is the, a religion? Yeah. Okay, Testigo de Jehová. Can you write that in English, please? Mormon. Okay. Catholic, Hindus. Ah, okay. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, look in the... Uh, uh, let me share. There is a website for a sort of dictionary online. I don't know if you know this one. This is an online dictionary for reference.com. Yeah, my favorite. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Uh, witness of Jehovah. Close. Close. Witness. But it witness. must be in English. Both words in English. Uh -huh. Krishna, Judaism. Okay. Or the Jewish. Okay. Okay, very good, very good. Medics. <laughs> well, that, I don't know, is among Christians, maybe. Okay, industries. Let's go to an easier category, okay? Category, okay? Industries. Mining and... <laughs> Oh my goodness. Industries. More industries, manufacturer. No, but what is the industry? Chemical, okay. Movies, art, education, mechanic, mechanic, okay, business, factory, fashion, ah, okay. Marketing and what is that industry? Sports, mechanical, okay. Very good. And finally, agricultural products. Milk, coffee. Beans. Rice. Bakery. Corn. Tomatoes, carrot, watermelon. Yeah, okay. Blueberry. Ah, that's easier, right? Pineapple. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, a lot of vocabulary here talking about different industries. Very good.
Any question, people? Mango. Okay. Okay, people, I think with this, um, we're going to stop here because the conversation, we won't have time to practice the conversation, but, well, maybe I just, just will have time to record it for you to practice the pronunciation later. So let me read it. I will read the conversation for you. Hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in Japan? Where? In Japan. I'm not sure. Isn't it the gen? Oh, yes. And do they drive on the left or the right? I think the left, but I'm not sure. Oh, well, is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Oh. Well, what about credit cards? Are American Express cards accepted there? How would I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? Travel agent? This is Linda's hair salon. Oh, sorry. Wrong number. Okay. Well, let's stop here tonight. Tomorrow we are going to continue with this conversation. At least you have the audio there. You can listen to it. And we're going to practice it tomorrow. Okay. Thank you for attending. And see you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. See you tomorrow, teacher. See you.